I will make it up this hill. Gravity oh, is not your friend. Hello, I'm Vikiti and I'll eat your soul and welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Unleashed. In the last episode, we did so many freaking night levels, it was a complete pain, but we're about to be free. We are we are freeing ourselves from the madness, and I got stuck on a, fo on a pole. Uh, sounds hi. painful. Hi, it sounds painful. <laughs> okay, so, um, now we just have to run very slowly to the world map and go through a quick tutorial. Hooray for that. Perfect. Loading, 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 loading. So how has your week been? <laughs> yeah, it's been lovely, delightful, chock full of work. Aww. Just the way we like it. Alright, so basically here Tails just tells you how to use the world map that's real interesting and stuff, but we want to get going with the levels because we already know how to use the world map. Well, sort of. Perfect. Oh, you gotta love video game logic, even when the planet is like that. Not only does it manage to contain its gravitational pull, but it... All the oceans are still there. Why use real physics when you can make up your own? <laughs> yeah. I reject your reality and substitute my own. That's basically that. <laughs> Honestly, I'd love to see, like, in-game, what would what would happen if the characters went up to the edge of the, the chunk of the world? Like, what would it look like? What is going on there? Is it's it like the a... Christ it's, it's the Christopher the Columbus of video games. <laughs> it's gotta be like a... It, the, the best comparable scenario would be like Minecraft, where when a chunk fails to load, the water doesn't update and start flowing over the edge until you hit it with something. Queen, Queen Isabella was right. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> hey, what's so funny? Quit that laughing. I won't have to do anything nasty. All you need to do is tell me where the Temple of Gaia is. We're not telling you anything. I need to add subtitles to my real life as well. It makes life so much easier. I'd like to have my life narrated by Morgan Freeman. That would be awesome. I'll play to call. Thanks for that little skydiving adventure the other day. I should have known you'd still be alive, you stubborn little hedgehog. What are you doing out here? Weird, I just noticed I about this cutscene. The mouth you. movements don't case, seem to be I synchronized. Well. It's from, like, like that for me in real life as well. I'm never in sync with my mouth. <laughs> hey, then. Is everyone here all right? Sonic seems to be fine. It was just that one part with Eggman that seemed a little off. Eh, can't get him all right, I guess. <laughs> no, exactly. Yeah, he actually speaks a foreign language. No one knows that. <laughs> so this is where I had trouble earlier. I wanted to just get to this point in the recording, collect a bunch of medals so we'd have more day levels, and then come back to this. But the game won't actually let you out of this area once you trigger that cutscene. Or rather, once you finish the uh, that one part where I was in rooftop run in the last episode. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, don't hit me, get off. Okay, anyway, um... <laughs> don't be afraid, everything's fine. That one part in the last episode, basically, you're stuck here, and you can't continue, so... The metal count may look a bit off after the boss in this level, to whoever's watching this, basically because I did all the metal collecting beforehand in a different file, and... There's just going to be a montage, we're going to clip it all out, and then we'll be back. Hooray! Once again, making our own rules. In the meantime, the magic of day levels! Hooray! Something interesting for once. Super speed! Hey, Don't forget your sunscreen. Oh yeah, it is sunny here, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I feel 
don't understand why the mud slows you down that much, but whatever, video game logic. Mm hmm. Talk homing about attack it. indicator, but for some reason it didn't take. Talk okay. about hitting the wall. Oh boy. <laughs> Maybe I can actually get that. Yep, I got the rainbow ring this time. Good. Congratulations. Okay, let's try not to die this time. Nope. Uh, I don't understand what's happening there. There's a homing attack indicator on that bar, but it's just not responding. You just can't, can't get, get good homing attack indicators these days. <laughs> okay, let's try that one more time with maybe 50% less failure. Third, to, third time's the charm. Trying not homing attacking on the first one this time. And there we go. Hooray. That's much better. Ow. So I finally got Sonic Generations working on my PC, because apparently my video card is really good, and I tried out one of the Unleashed levels that was ported as a mod. It's very glitchy. <laughs> well, so is real life. So it's just like real life. Touche. Real life, the only place where you can walk on thin air for no apparent reason. I'm doing it right now. Hooray. What? I am 12. What is this? Um, okay then. Oh god! Well, here's your problem. Ow. Okay, well, that was an unexpected turn of events. Surprise! <laughs> oh, Havoc Physics Engine, you and your quirks. It's like Sonic 06, but with less stupid. And more noise. Oh yeah, I guess that too. Uh, to be fair, Sonic Unleashed does run a lot better than Sonic 06, but it does still have its bugs. Most of which are attributed to a really weird control scheme, but I digress. Just like in real life. <laughs> hey, I actually got that this time. Hooray. Okay, this part is the part that usually takes me off guard. Watch your friends. Good luck, we're all counting on Now, okay, that was a failure. Come on. Not gonna go out of, way, out of my way to get that moon medal because I already got it in my other file. Which you guys will probably see in the clip montage later. But you could always have a spare in case you lose one. I suppose. Hey, I actually got that on the first try. What do you know? Congratulations. How's that? That's great. That's how that is. You must bring good luck. Every time I do a recording with you, I always have good luck, except when yeah. it's a night level. All of my gaming expertise, of course, of which I have none. You bring good luck during the day. Thank you so much. <laughs> and here we are back in the day. Oh, he's back.
You tell him. This boss actually does get me sometimes. I can do it easily on the Wii version. There's actually a funny story behind that. One of my friends had the Wii version at one point. I took it out from the library later because it looked fun. And I played this boss. I got S rank on it. So I decided, oh, I'll go, you know, show him how well I can play this boss. He brought out the PS3 version, which I had assumed at the time was the same version. Uh, nope. I suck at this version. And well, I got E rank. There's no better time to learn. Oh, okay, yeah, see, I'm already dead. It burns. See, I always try to get him, like, just by jumping and hitting him with the homing attack. But that doesn't always quite work, because my t I can never get the timing right, and I just walked right into that one. Learn to cheat. <laughs> if, if at first you don't succeed, cheat. That could work. Come on, please give me some rings. Ow! Now, that's another thing that gets me on that one. Even if I do get the timing right, sometimes the angles can be really off. And it doesn't always work right. Again, just like real life. <laughs> the Havoc, the, to be fair, the Havoc engine is pretty accurate at times, but when it's programmed even slightly incorrectly, you get shit like horses climbing mountains or Sonic 06 in its entirety. Well, you can't have everything. And if the horses were just mountain goats, then you wouldn't think twice. <laughs> Away with you, Eggman! Ow! Hey, I got that one. Hooray. Congratulations. Always jump at just the wrong time. Oh, God! <laughs> There we go. So close. You sure talk to us about nothing. Ow. Okay, that was weird. I thought I was dead there. You were just stunned. Ow. Okay, yeah, he's gonna come back for another round. Good for that, I guess. Sometimes it glitches out like that, but whatever. This should be the part where I actually get him, if I don't die, anyway. You can do it. We're all counting on Yay! I'm important! <laughs> Ow. He's laughing at me. You hurt my feelings. Nah. He's mean. He has <laughs> issues. Away with you! Away with you, good sir! Scram! Beat it! Wow, that's that's a glitchy effect in slow motion. How's that? Oh, that's my best rank yet on that. There you go, see? There's hope for you yet. Take your hair and make a luck charm. <laughs> I'll see what I can arrange. <laughs> Is that the Temple of Gaia? Let's check it out. And another loading screen. I fail to understand why there's another loading screen between two cutscenes, but whatever. There's so much loading to be done. You're stuck in the loading zone. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> you can't, but you can't park there. That actually makes so much sense. <laughs> See? I see the Hanna-Barbera running sound effect used uh, quite well. <laughs> Scooby-Doo will be right behind you. <laughs> What's that? Uh, actually, there are actually quite a few effects like that in this game that fit surprisingly well. Great. The emerald that's actually an emerald. This was the Temple of Gaia. That's got to be why Eggman was so keen on taking the place over. Suddenly, Indiana Jones. <laughs> da, 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 da. Space, the final frontier. No, that's something else. That's something. <laughs> Suddenly, Sonic Colors! <laughs> it could happen. Zoinks? Hooray for pre-rendered cutscenes played twice. Think of the time you'll say. How does he talk with his mouth on the side of his face like that? Pop, I did it for years. Oh, um, I actually forgot about that. All right, then. There you go. Forget it, that. I regularly eat at Wimpy's restaurant. See? He hides it well. <laughs> Interestingly, it was always the side facing the camera. Hmm. Fun fact with the models for these games, all the characters that have mouths on either side of their face have two mouths in the models. Perfect. Well, they're definitely speaking out of both sides of their face. I remember seeing the Knuckles model when it was leaked from the demo of uh, Generations. I couldn't figure out, I couldn't for the life of me figure out why he had two mouths, but I just went with it. Makes it really hard to drink soup. I suppose so. Um, well, change of plans, I guess, since we're about 20 minutes into this already, we'll be doing the, the next day stage in the next episode, but... For now, I guess we'll just end this off with a clip montage of collecting a bunch of medals. We'll sure. see you in the next episode, guys, I guess. If it weren't for you meddling kids. No, that's from another show again, I'm sorry. Oh, not that, boy, then. Not that type of medal. <laughs> we'll see you then, guys. Bye-bye.